I have 145K on my B8 and a half S4. Would lowering springs be okay to install with stock shocks considering their lifespan or would coilovers make more sense for lowering the car and improving ride quality? Do you have any, t <laughs> um, okay, that's a separate question. Um, you know, 145,000 isn't necessarily a bad thing for your shocks and struts. Yeah, and mileage is a really tough metric to know how, yeah. how used up a shock is. If you've just been driving back and forth on I-80, you know, for the last five years, then no, it's, it, it shouldn't have worn. But if, you, if you've been driving on bumpy roads and gravel roads and off-roading, you've hit lots of big potholes, and you know, then, it, then it's possible that your factory shocks could be worn. I would still encourage you to, to run our springs with factory uh, magnetic ride shocks if, if you have the option. But if your car feels fine and it's not too bouncy or wallowy right now, then I don't think you'd, you'd have a concern there. Um, we, we've discussed the merits of coilovers and some of the pitfalls a number of times, so Sean could maybe link you back to some of those videos. Um, but yeah, again, if, if, if your car has seen relatively light highway use, as they say, then 145K is not a problem.